Hey everybody, Mr. B. <laughs> I'm Mrs. B. And Boxer B. Hey Boxer B. I know, she's my little girl. How y'all doing? We hope you're doing uh, well, um, having a good day or night, whatever time it is. Mm -hmm. Yep. We're just gonna hang out for a little bit. Um, about a month or so ago, we ordered some of the Linda's Fiery Treats, and she always throws in some uh, some little samples. We haven't tried this one yet. We haven't reviewed it. We haven't tasted it. <laughs> this one is called, oh, you know what? It's got the League of Fire, uh, it's got the League of Fire little uh, logo on it, which means maybe if you did a full bag, that could be a, uh, a competition oh. snack. Oh. And it also says X, 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 X Reaper. Like a 4X. It's like a 4X. Yeah, but the rest of it says maple candy oh. cashews. It's like, oh. you know what? It's like that big monster, but it's covered in feathers. <laughs> well, this one's not covered in feathers. It's covered in Reaper, but... Exactly. Oh, but maple. It has some maple in there. So it can't be all that bad. Maple. Maple's great. I love maple. I love maple. Maple on syrup. My, on my pancakes. On my shoulder. I wonder. Makes me sticky. I wonder if this would be a good top, like a pancake topper. Ooh. Mm -hmm. We're finding things that would be amazing on vanilla ice cream. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are. Pink, pink. These are uh, cashews, huh? Yes, those are cashews. They look like cashews. <clears throat> Cashews? Cashews. Cashews. Where were Kazuma. we? Where were we? <clears throat> um, oh, it's Thailand. We actually went to a cashew farm. We did. And uh, so Girl, cashews chill. have a lot of acidity. And, and when they were, when the Thai people were pulling the, or taking the cashew out of the shell, they were using gloves because of the... Well, they said it was very acidic. It has, to, it has to be processed. You can't just uh, eat it no. straight off of the tree. It needs Isn't that to be crazy. Yeah, like you can't just pull it from a tree or get it from a plant. How do they grow? How do, how do they grow? I don't know. How do they do it? <laughs> wow. Oh my God! You guys must think we're dorks. But I just remember we're in Thailand. <coughs> we went to a Thai cashew farm. It was cool. It was so great. The cashews were amazing. I loved tasting all of them, especially the ones with the lemongrass in it. Oh, and uh, today we're tom having... Tom Yum. They had the Tom Yum seasoning. Yes, yes. Tom Yum. They have it as a uh, soup. They had it as a seasoning for cashews. Yeah, it was so good. Excellent. But today, sorry, just seeing the cashews reminded me of that. Um, and we do... do <laughs> and we do do that. We do. Uh, like to talk about our travels, where we've been, and you know, spices that we've had. So, the caches are taking me back a little to You know Thailand. what we gotta do is, maybe when we're talking about one of our travels to uh, Thailand, we'll pick up a full bag of these. Oh yes, in, in the Tom Yum. Tom Yum. <laughs> but today, today We're gonna we try the are... sample of uh, XXXX X. The 4X. Reaper. 4X. Maple 4X. candied walnut. Was that what it was? The label melted off. Okay. Are you ready? <coughs> Getting my throat ready. Okay. I'm just going to go for it. Let's do it. Mm. Mm. I quickly started getting some of the Reaper. I have no spice. I'm getting into the candied uh, flavoring. I'm getting sweetness. How about you? I have no heat yet. Very slight heat. It's kind of unusual. It had four X's of heat. I'm getting a little bit on the sides of my tongue. I'm getting a little bit on the sides of my tongue as well. More, mom, more maybe in the middle for me. It, it's weird. I'm getting a couple of flavors that seem to be battling each other. Yeah. I'm getting kind of that uh, reaper flavor that comes maple. in and dominates, mm -hmm. and then I'm getting kind of like a brown sugary, cinnamony or something flavor, and then it goes back to reaper. That's strange. Yeah. That's good. Um, they probably could have taken off three of those X's. 
if, if you have a very low tolerance, you know, probably one or two of these are going to uh, really burn until you do like True. we're doing, kind of, you know, try to increase our tolerance. Yeah. Because remember, like we said and what we've learned, the higher your tolerance for uh, spiciness, um, the more you're going to taste the flavors that are part of it. You're not going to just have burn. You're going to taste sweet. You're going to taste the coconut, right? Yes. Yes. Uh, uh, so I have to say, we were tasting some of Linda's other treats, and um, some of those are really good. They're very good. This is not super coconutty. They're not super sweet, but it's quite nice actually because you don't have a lot of that forefront sugar, in, you know, in the front part of um, of this treat. It kind of just blends in with the chili, but you're right. They do kind of battle each other, so I don't have I don't have a lot of one and not a lot of other. Let me ask you this: but they're each balanced. Did you get any of the maple? Very little. Did you? No. No. No, I you got. Didn't. I got some of the uh, kind of like brown sugar notes, which may have been hints of the maple. I think that's what it would be. Um, that candy, candy nut, you know, flavor. It was. It was tasty. Um. It wasn't as hot as I expected, and it wasn't as maple-y. <laughs> Sophia and Rosebud, enough. Sorry. It's what can you do? <laughs> Sophia. Anyhow, go to Linda's Fiery Treats if you want to try these or uh, some of the other goodies she has. Uh, when in season, those dogs. Oh, um, yeah. <clears throat> we gotta meditate tonight. We do, we do, we do have to meditate. <clears throat> but um, I think the treats are really good. Worth worth you ordering them. Um, just to try them, yeah. to see uh, what you think, to see if you're experiencing, you know, what we're we're tasting. You may get, you may taste different things. You may have different uh, experiences with it. Think it's hotter or uh, more mild than we do. Hey, try them, buy them. Uh, let us know. We want to compare. We don't really know where we fit in this whole thing. Obviously, somebody like Johnny Scoville or Uncle Bocow, you know, one of them, you know, if they were to eat this, they may be like, we don't taste any heat. Um, I mean, or I'm not going crazy like over this. I mean, I'm we've had stuff where our crazy. face has been burning off. That's not one of them. It's pretty nice. Not to say that on a different day, it could give us more of a burn. Definitely. Um, I, I say I would love to make some uh, waffles and crunch some of this up on the waffle. Oh, with that'd be good. Syrup. Oh, put it in the batter. Yes. Yeah, because they put they put nuts in well, batter. Throw some bananas mm, on top or something and some maple syrup. I would think more like chopping it up and putting it as a topper. It's doable. You could do it both ways and see how they... Uh, I don't know. Stay in tune for that because we should. Do some uh, breakfast. Oh, yeah. Let's make some breakfast stuff. Okay, guys. And gals. Yes. Um, thank you so much for watching us. Thank you for liking, subscribing, and sharing. And smiling. Yes. That's that's our main goal is to bring smiles to your faces. Um, ah. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you hit that notification bell. Yeah. It always, so you always know when we're doing something. Yeah. Um, we have other challenges that we will be doing. They've already arrived. Check out our uh, unboxing videos to see yeah. what the latest. A lot of new and exciting things. Uh, a lot of videos coming up. You know, we haven't really been able to um, do a video every day or really get content out there because of what just happened to our father-in-law, you know, his father, who we love very, very much. And, um, and so things are going to be a little slow. You're going to be at mom's house for a little bit. So we're going to, we're going to have stuff, try to get content out daily just to keep you smiling and keep in uh, touch with you guys. Uh, we love you. Check out uh, the people, businesses, and organizations we love. Yes. Links are in the description. Linda's Fiery Treats if you want to try some of the things we've tried. Um, let us know. You know, if you throw some of this into some ice cream or into a pancake or a waffle mix, 
And throw yeah. some syrup oh, on it. Some and... muffins. Oh, oh muffins. Goodness. You're just, yes. You'll just have like a little hint of a spice. Or maybe you'll have yeah. even more of it, more than a hint. But let us know. Make sure, uh, thank you, and, and make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys soon. Bye.